Phil. Oh, Phil. Uh, he was found near South High. Uh, some kids were unfortunately treating him pretty poorly with sticks. Uh, somebody found him and called him in, and the person's name was Phil, and they requested that we name the little porky pet here, Lil Phil. So this is Lil Phil. They are born with quills, uh, which harden not long after they're born. So this little critter does have quills. Um, obviously they don't shoot them like maybe you've heard. Um, they basically, if they brush against you or back into you or give you a tail slap, that's kind of how they deliver their, um, their quill. Or their quill. Furry, fluffy, fluff hair. That's an adaptation for warmth. They do live in Alaska where it's very cold in the winter, so they stay warm. Uh, he is a mammal, so that's the hair part of it. Um, you can see those little claws that he uses to climb with. They're expert climbers. Um, and, you know, kind of a, a note, um, when you find, or if you do find or see an animal uh, baby or pup or kitten, um, that seems to be alone, um, just observe it for, you know, like 24 hours. If it's injured or obviously hurt, you know, that's kind of a different situation. But if the animal's just kind of out there by itself, just keep an eye on it because uh, often mom or dad animal will, will leave the little, uh, little baby by itself and often will return. So a lot of people kind of intercept that natural process. They think they're helping, but, you know, they kind of have interrupted the natural scheme of things. But yeah, so... If you